So you guys know I've talked about at-home laser, but what about at-home electrolysis? Have I tried it? Have I used it? Does it work? I personally have never tried an at-home electrolysis device. I mean, I would. I'm totally open to it. It sounds cool, but it's a very intricate and delicate process. If you're not properly trained, it either won't be effective or you can actually hurt yourself. So as of now, I have not found an at-home electrolysis kit that I believe in enough to say that it's worth getting over a salon. So if one comes up, it comes up. But as of now, just go to a salon. So what are some alternatives for electrolysis? Obviously you've heard me talk about this many, many times, but laser hair removal is a great option. It's not for everybody, but it worked great for me. Now laser works by treating a larger section of hair. It detects the melanin in the hairs and with a laser, a flash of light, it slowly reduces the hair growth over time. Now this doesn't work on lighter hairs. It doesn't work on thinner hairs and it doesn't work for everybody. Also, it usually doesn't treat every single individual hair, so most often a combination of laser hair removal and electrolysis is recommended. That's what I did. Laser and electrolysis can be very pricey in salons, so if you're looking to get started on a budget at home, obviously you guys know I've talked about it so many times because I love it. The Catch Beauty at Home IPL laser hair removal system works great. If you just want to start your laser hair removal journey at home, they have a few different models. I've used all of them. I personally use the V4.1 as of now. I feel like it's still a little bit stronger. All of them are amazing. If you are looking to have permanent hair removal, spend the money on an at-home solution and then go to a salon for electrolysis to clean up later.